beautiful it is so soft you guys this is the definition of soft i can't be weak no no you can't touch this hey we try to reach huh my money thick thick hey walk with a limp limp huh i'm on some pimp sh hey he say you all about money yeah i'm on that cash huh What's up, Lenny Nation? I'm back again, and today I'm going to be doing a hair review for Eunice Hair, and I'm going to be showing you guys how I install my wigs and, you know, stuff like that. I know you've heard about Eunice Hair. They are the best, simple, period. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Follow my social media platforms. There'll be in the description box below. Also, the information about this hair unit will be in the description box below. And most importantly, hit that subscribe button, join the family, join the gang. And with that being said, let's go. Alright, y'all. So Eunice Hair sent me this 20-inch Brazilian straight lace wig. And I am so excited to see it. It comes with a pair of lashes as well. These are really cute. It has 150% density. So you already know my wigs. I like my wigs really full. So that's a plus. Um Ooh. first of all let's talk about how soft this wig is let's do a quick test i'm going to use a rat tooth comb to come through i'm amazed Eunice hair you did your thing i love this already it's so smooth and so soft and it's not shedding at all like literally it is going so smooth Right now, I'm going to show you guys how I prep for my wig installation and then I'm going to actually show you guys how I install my wigs. So the first thing I do is I put the wig on my mannequin's head inwards and then I grab my airbrush leg spray and I start to spray the lace from a distance. I don't want to bring it too close so it's not too much. I spray it all so it can match my skin tone and actually, you know, melt down right. And then I use my powder brush to blend it in a little so it doesn't look too harsh. I'm going to go over this process again and do the same thing with my powder brush. And then I'll take it off the mannequin's head. Just like that. The next thing I'm going to do is spray my wig cap as well so it blends well with the lace I just sprayed and do not worry if you get a little bit of the spray on your face or you know where you do not want it to be all you have to do is use some tissue clean it all up and then you're good. And now I'm going to wear the wig to see how it fits and it fits right it's not too big it's not too small it is true to its size all i need to do is cut a little bit off the ear area because my head is quite small and now i'm going to use these little black clips to hold both sides so i can apply my got to be glued gel and also this spray to use to lay my wig down okay so what i'm doing now is i'm going to use this rat tail comb or what my fellow nigerians call a tail comb i'm going to use the tail of the comb to apply my got to be glued gel on my edges so i'll be able to you know lay the wig right and in the way i want it to so that's what i'm doing right now And when I'm done using the gel, I'm going to grab my got to be glued spray, spray right on the gel, yes, directly on the gel. And I'm also going to go back and use my toilet paper to clean a little bit off because, you know, it started dripping. So, yeah, I'll just wait for it to get dry a little before I place the lace back down. That's what I'm doing. I really could have used a hand dryer, but like, you know, it just, I don't know. <laughs> and now I'm going to just place the list down and allow it to melt itself. I'm going to use the rat to comb to, you know, lay it down more. And then I'll use my scarf to make sure I get the meltdown I want. Yeah, 
then after i tie my scarf i wait for a little while before i take it off so i could cut off the lace so when i'm cutting my lace i start by cutting the middle and then the side and then the other side this way is easier for me because i barely make mistakes it's easier to get the precise hairline and you don't cut too much or too less i was really having a hard time showing you guys how i cut it because i was trying not to make a mistake due to the fact that i wasn't trying to look you know out of the camera but when i'm cutting i cut in a zigzag motion i don't just cut it straight because that way it will make you look you know more natural Hey guys, so this is how it's looking right now. I've put a little bit of foundation in the front so it can blend, even though it was already blended, but that's just something I do when I lay my wigs. So basically now I'm just going to style the wig and make it look even more beautiful. It is so soft, you guys. This is the definition of soft. I'm just going in with my electric hot comb and then I'm going to use my slick stick to slick the hairs that always you know want to poke out down and make it look more neat and yeah that's basically all i'm doing right now then i'm just going to comb the hair the way i want it you guys if you can't tell this hair is literally so soft i can't resist combing it so i'm done styling the hair and i want my part to be a little bit more evident so i'm going to use my concealer brush and a little bit of concealer to go just through the part in the middle just so it can look a little bit more you know natural and evident and i'm done y'all this is all i do when it comes to me installing my wigs i am so satisfied with this unit it's so soft and easy to lay down the lace melted so easy i didn't have to pluck bleach or do anything thanks to unit's hair y'all should check the link in the description to get yourselves one unit at least from Eunice Hair. They're having a back to school sale. So you guys should hurry up and go get yours. And with that being said, I'll see you guys in my next video.